Hi, just a quick announcement video for a giveaway of some hopefully working BM235 multimeters. Why do I say hopefully? Well, if you're not familiar, um, I sell my uh, products, my BM235 on Amazon and I get it. Uh, uh, I actually get Amazon to fulfill that. It's called FBA or Fulfilled by Amazon. If you don't know, there's two ways you can sell things on Amazon. One is to set up your store on Amazon and you do your own fulfillment. So it's just like a shopping cart type interface and then Amazon sends you the names and addresses and you can use shopping cart software and you print your labels and you pack and ship all the products but uh, I use the Amazon service for that where they actually I just bulk ship them entire boxes of multimeters and I sell a lot of multimeters on uh, Amazon I have to keep running out of stock um, in fact they'll Amazon's really good actually so I'm just going to go into the spiel about um, selling on Amazon here even though they do take a huge I think it's like 17% or something if you want to uh, use the fulfillment by Amazon service but they not only hold uh, stock your product, they hold it, um, they sell it, they warranty it, they uh, handle customer, the shipping, packing and shipping, and they handle uh, the returns and all sorts of, uh, you know, stuff like that. So they handle everything, but they uh, do charge a hefty premium for that. So one way is for you to ship it yourself and you pay a lower fee. Uh, but if you want Amazon to uh, pack it and ship it and support it and do all the rest of it, apparently um, somebody posted once you can actually get phone support from, yeah, free Amazon tech support included. There you go. I don't know if anyone's ever tried to phone up Amazon tech support uh, to get like, oh, oh, my BM235 multimeter doesn't work. Call up Amazon tech support and see if they know anything about it. Anyway, they're supposed to support the product and Amazon have got, got a good return service. Apparently I've never used it uh, myself, but apparently it's really easy to return stuff. And oops, that's the high res photos there. There you go, you can see inside it. Oh, isn't that nice? How many, uh, how many uh, <laughs> um, sellers actually provide internal teardown photos like that? Anyway, so I get them to do everything, even though it's a hefty uh, fee. But it, it just really works and the money just, you know, comes into my account and I just bulk ship them um, entire uh, boxes worth. It's great. Anyway, uh, fulfilled by Amazon. What happens if people return these products um, uh, due to, I don't know, they don't like the blue holster? They thought it was red and they just, they got a blue one and they don't like it, they return it. I think Amazon, as I said, have like a no questions asked return policy or whatever. Or uh, or if they determine, uh, the people in the warehouse determine that, um, you know, like a box has been damaged in transit, you know, and it looks crushed or something like that, they don't want to uh, ship it. So what happens is that they... Um, I've, in my Amazon system here, I could see that they're... Uh, these are called unfulfillable items. So these are either, uh, you can see here, three of them are customer damaged. So I've got six units at the moment um, that have either been uh, customer damaged and returned um, or three defective, whatever that means. I assume defective just means returned because, I don't know, they changed their mind, they didn't like or whatever. And I've um, done this, given away these meters a couple of times before, and they've always been fine. There's been nothing wrong with them. So it could just be like a little, you know, crushed box or something like that, or uh, people have just changed their mind. Anyway, so I think sometimes they might actually put these back on the shelf if they deem them to be worthy to be sold. But if they're not worthy to be resold, oh, and also, I keep thinking of stuff. I think I tweeted this, um, last month is that I think Amazon were actually reselling a refurbished, I don't know if it's a BM235 or a 121G, GW, they were reselling a refurbished one. This is a fit like Amazon, the seller is Amazon Warehouse. It's not a third party person, I believe it's Amazon Warehouse have decided to start reselling them. Anyway, there's these unfulfillable ones and you can, and they will actually destroy these meters. They'll crush them, do whatever, um, if you don't dispose of them within a certain amount of time. They'll only ho hold them for a certain amount of time. So if I don't get rid of these, um, somehow they'll just crush them. So that's a complete waste. Unfortunately, I can't get them shipped back to me. I can only ship, here is the, if you actually uh, go into the, uh, here it is, create removal order here. And I can only ship to a US uh, destination. So unfortunately, this giveaway is only for 
US residents, sorry, don't complain. It's got nothing to do with me. I just want to give away these six meters before they crush them. And I have given these away before. And I had, I think, four to give away before. I did this on the forum. And when I went to actually ship them, it was down to three. So I don't know what happened to that one. Maybe that was one they deemed good and they resold. So I can't guarantee there will be six available by the time I finish this video. Anyway, I'm rambling too much. So I'm going to give away six of these, um, but not individual ones. I'm going to give away uh, two lots of three. So hopefully um, I'll select two winners and we'll get, and you'll get hopefully three meters each in unguaranteed condition. Sorry. Um, please do keep us informed um, and what condition they come in. And if they work, I'm pretty confident they will. Anyway, uh, I don't want to see them crushed, so I'm going to give them away. So only to US residents and sorry, not to individuals. I want to give them away to a school or a hacker space or some other, you know, maker group, something like that. Um, so please leave it in the comments down below why you want, which group you belong to, which school or whatever. And uh, the two that get the most thumbs up, not guaranteed, but the two, if I feel they're dodgy or not worthy, um, the two that get the most fun thumbs up, um, we'll get them at, at my discretion. Um, anyway, and you have to be contactable because people in YouTube comments are often just not contactable. It's really annoying when I try and give stuff away on YouTube. But, oh, oh foolish me, I'll do it again. Um, so, yeah, so thumbs up. Who do you think will get down below? Who do you think will get should get um, three multimeters a pop? Hopefully. So yes, you have to be, you have to have verifiable uh, bona fides so that you're a group, you're a school or whatever. So I don't want somebody just pretending to be because I can smell <laughs> bullshit a mile away. So I, no one pretending to be a school or a hacker group or something like that. I want, you know, verifiable. Anyway, Leave it in the comments down below. Thumbs up. So, yeah, hopefully we can give these away before they crush them. I'm not sure what the deadline is. doesn't actually say. Uh, anyway, I've got 52 left in stock. It recommends I send an, another 180 units. Re YouTube, uh, YouTube. Amazon, like, give you all based on sales trends and stuff like that, saying, alert, send another 180 multimeters. Okay, just got back from holidays. I think I've got that in stock. I'll have to ship it to them. Anyway, there you go. Thumbs up, leave it if you're a group down below, all that sort of stuff. Catch you next time.